Hello, I'm Susan Cress. I retired in 2012 as English professor and vice president for academic affairs from Skidmore, a small liberal arts college in upstate New York. And since 2012, I've been associated with Arohi either as board or committee member. Before I retired, Skidmore had received a $100,000 grant from the American Council on Education and Alfred P. Sloan Foundation to support innovative retiree transitions. And that award led to our connection with Arohi, the expert on retirement in higher education. Used to be that retirees would just drop off an institution's radar, but we've learned with Arohi as our beacon that retirement's not an exit, but one more transition in the arc of the faculty and staff life cycle, one that requires thoughtful programming and structural support. I hope you've already sampled Arohi's marvelous resources on the website, the briefs that showcase successful programs, webinars that convene members to discuss topics like the age-friendly university, conferences that feature cutting-edge speakers like Paul Irving at our upcoming September summit, and consultation services that help you create a retiree organization and keep it thriving. I can tell you that my small college has benefited enormously from the pioneering practices of other retiree associations we've met through Arohi. And we've contributed to the website too, specifically our work on creating a retiree library and on developing a grant program for staff as well as faculty. There's a new focus on what it means to reach, I'll use Louise Aronson's term, elderhood, in a world where the voices of elders are not necessarily heard. It's a moment when we especially need advocates for our aging populations, and Arohi is our most powerful collective voice in higher ed. Arohi is the organization that promotes the success of retiree associations, both nationally and internationally, and it's uniquely poised to transform both the experience and the perception of retirement itself. Happy 20th anniversary, Arohi. We look forward to many more.